Okay, it's April 12th. It's been a pretty long extended cold winter. So, just kind of an update on my colonies. I typically have three. We actually had three that swarmed in mid-October, which is basically the suicide you know, process. And so, as I expected, both of those colonies were weak going into winter, and they didn't make it. This colony right here is the colony I taped last uh, fall, we, re we rescued it from a developer that was going to bulldoze a wooded area and there, were, there was a colony in there. We weren't sure, given how late in the year, whether it was going to survive. It's very weak. I can tell by the traffic that's going in and out, so I don't know if it's going to make it or not, but um, we're, we're going to take a look. So, um, we'll get started. Go ahead and cut. So I always give them a little bit of smoke. Um, my smoker's been burning for a while, so there's not too much left in there. And I think you'll find this interesting. Right underneath this, there's a feeder. And you'll be able to see how much the bees have eaten. So this was solid. Is it okay or is it too bright? This was solid, and the bees have come up through the hole in the middle and gone and eaten their way out. Um, again, there just aren't very many bees in here, so that's why I'm a little bit worried about it. So there should be a lot more bees on a decent day like this. Okay, it's cold, but there's a nice, good cluster here, so you can kind of see. Um, for uh, It's a little cool, but I don't understand why there aren't more bees and the queen's not laying because it has been very warm. I'm going to try to pull out a couple frames. So look at them. So like I said, this is the this is the colony we rescued from uh, the developer. It was going to get destroyed. A few more bees flying now. They're starting to wake up. In fact, just get them to dive down a little bit. Been stuck in here for a while. for is we're looking to see if they have any uh, any brood in here and if not I'm a little worried well these you'd think that there wouldn't be this many bees still if the queen had died so we'll see there very maybe well could be oh yeah there's definitely brood in here so I'll take this out so you can see it Not very much. So these are the eggs that the queen has laid right here where you can see. And maybe some have hatched recently. Um, and then I don't know if you can see right in the inside through the sun with the angle. Can you see the the larva in there, the white larva? Are you getting a good picture of that? Alright, why don't you go ahead and pause the, the camera for a minute. Alright, so um, just wanted to see, since there's so few bees, it's pretty easy to find the queen. If you see her right there, you can zoom in on her a little bit. She, she likes to hide under the other bees sometimes a little bit. Um, but she is laying eggs, not very much, and uh, there's plenty of space. So, um, not too worried um, about adding more space yet. So she's just working around on this one, and this, this, this one does not have any... Uh, there might be a few eggs in one of these, but there's very few eggs on this frame. So, wanted to show you that. That's the end of the inspection for today. Have a great day. Thanks.